Good morning, everyone. I'm Storm Tracker for Meteorologist Victoria Marshall with a look at your weather for the day today. A much colder day in store for the valley. We have a wind advisory that's currently in place until 3 p.m. That's because winds are blowing in out of the north at 20 to 25 miles per hour sustained. In some cases, 30 miles per hour and some gusts will make it up to 40 to 45 miles per hour. With temperatures in the low 40s right now and falling, you combine that wind with the temperature and you'll get a wind chill falling to the low 30s by the afternoon possibly into the upper 20s by the morning. So we do have a wind chill advisory that's in effect through 6 p.m. today. Expect to keep the clouds and the drizzle around for the majority of your day. As a matter of fact, that wind really helping to get those power outages going across the Rio Grande Valley today. Uh, we have seen uh, some as many as up to a thousand people in Hidalgo County or more as well as Cameron County without power. Crews will be working to restore that throughout the day today. But again, that is one of the things that we have seen with this cold front. 8 a.m., 40 degrees to get you out the door. By noon, 39 degrees. Temperatures falling to 37 degrees by 5 p.m. will keep the overcast skies, the clouds, the cold, and the showers coming in sort of waves throughout the day for the valley. Let's take you to your forecasted winds. They'll stay out of the northwest today between 20 and 30. By 6 p.m., we'll start to see those winds relaxing some down to about 10 to 20 miles an hour through the overnight hours then by tomorrow morning again 10 to 15 mile an hour winds out of the north. It's going to be extremely chilly through the day today. We're going to be falling into the 30s by this afternoon, upper 30s. And as we go ahead and take you through 10 p.m. this evening, you notice those showers picking up, moving from the southwest to the northeast. In some cases overnight, we could see those temperatures dropping to near freezing. If they do, we'll see the chance for some freezing drizzle. But other than that, it could stay liquid and that would only be up until around 7 a.m. After 7 a.m., we'll make it back into the upper 30s to low 40s by the afternoon hours, then the mid 40s by 5 p.m. We'll keep the clouds around on your Friday, but we'll see a break in the showers and maybe even a few peaks of sun into your Friday afternoon. Then as we go ahead and take you into your Saturday, we'll be back up to 56. We'll keep the clouds around with some isolated showers, but the rain picks up once again on your Sunday, 61 degrees Sunday, 64 Monday with still some lingering clouds. Then by Tuesday, Wednesday, conditions do improve to close to 70. But again, I really want to stress for you to dress your kids in multiple layers. Uh, check your plants, your pets, your pipes. Remember the three P's overnight tonight and make the preparations for a couple of cold days for us here in the valley.